bad, reflex good, will good. It doesn't actually give us a number. Hmm. Up top oh. on the chart, it'll say what your good save is and what your bad save is. So, for instance, your good save is plus three and your bad saves are plus zero. Oh, is that it? It's back up on the stats chart for Idolin. <clears throat> Okay. Oh, I see. Yeah. Yep. All right. So fort good, and it goes up every turn. So, so my fort saves a plus three right now. Uh, my reflex is also plus three, and my will is plus zero. At the moment. Okay, and I have eight skills and one feat. So my AC, my AC goes up to four because it's two at the moment, right? Yeah, so I'm just adding, yeah. I just add it on top of whatever it is, right? Yeah. Your AC starts at ten always. Right, No. But, uh, the Eidolon starts with... Um, a dex bonus. Do I just make a character sheet for this thing? Yes. Is that how? We like have I to do said, it? when you make a uh, summoner, you make two characters. Uh, I did not know that. Okay. I I said it. I know. I I didn't hear you. Oh, <laughs> you ignored me because you thought I didn't know what I was talking about. Okay. Your okay. eidolon talks to you. You guys share brainwaves and are like, let's be telepaths. Oh, that doesn't sound familiar to any of my other characters in any of my Not other at games. all. Not at all, no. Is insurance salesman a class in Pathfinder? As expert. a matter of fact, it is. There's an expert. NPC class called Expert. <laughs> you could take Profession Barrister. All right, Buckley has a sheet now. Which one is Buckley? That's the Edelon. Okay, what's your character's name? Tris Christmas. Tell you, man, sort of Christmas has to be a thing. You're looking to recover your ancestral sword of your family from the evil witches who stole it. The sword of Christmas. There you go, you just made my character. <laughs> Alright, is there like an Edelon drop down I can have here or something like that? Probably not. So what what class do I put it under for the automatic fill outs? I don't know. I can just leave it blank. And I just usually it do it by hand. Show dumb. All right, so uh, Dave doesn't have ears. That is a thing that I find highly suspect, considering you can see them next to his face covering <laughs> right here. It's true. I don't have ears. Dave, can you prove that you don't have ears? Can you just live? I can't them? prove that I don't not have ears. That's because you can't prove a negative. It's not possible. Boom. Get fucked, internet. All right. Um... I don't know that the internet's the one getting fucked here. I think that I'm so confused. It's okay. <laughs> I wish I was playing World of Warships. <laughs> yeah. I know what um, I'm doing then. I hold the W key down and I point directly at the enemy. God, I wish there was like... Maybe there is a... I'm just going to Google that real quick. You're probably better off just making a custom sheet real quick. The one I have is like it auto-fills. Alright. Gotta get that auto-fill money. Uh, yeah. Alright, Game of Siren, what can you tell us about your character so far? Um, well... 22 uh, strength, zero dex, negative con, <laughs> your name is Dan 2.0, <laughs> you dual wield daggers and you move into close range to try to get lots of sick crits. Um, How no. How correct am I so far? No. Well, my strength is 12. I've been wrong on every point. <laughs> my dexterity is 18. 
My con's 11. And my int was in charisma all 10. You still have way more points. Yeah, it Do I? sound like a lot of points. Uh, it's 20 yeah. points. You put an uh, 18 into something, though. So that's oh, good. you know what you did? Uh, go to the race drop-down menu and select halfling. I did. Uh, it should have a plus two racial mod, that, and under actual, that should so you actually have a twenty dex. Okay. Which you, you don't need a twenty okay. dex starting out. And hey, Dan, don't listen to him. And you can probably get a twenty. You do what dex. you want. Don't listen to Dan. He's trying to dissuade you from being awesome. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna keep the dex. Don't forget, you get another plus two to put in any state you want following the quest. Oh. And your charisma is probably 12 as well, or f 12 as well, yeah, for being a halfling. So does a summoner need anything in particular to, to work charisma. real good aside from a charisma? A ton of it. Was that? You could be crippled in every other stat as long as you have charisma as a summoner. Right. As a summoner, you basically want to hide around the corner while your Eidolon does the business. And any time anyone gets near you... You switch places with your Eidolon and be like, Oh, my Eidolon's going to deal with that shit now. You can literally bait and switch from like a mile away and just be like, High five, Eidolon. Are ogres kosher in Pathfinder? Yes. Ogres exist. They even have half-ogres called Ogrekin. And they're fucking terrifying. Yeah, they're also really hard to play as player characters because they have a huge int penalty. Okay, my actual is 10 strength, 20 dex, 13 con, 10 int, 10 whiz, and 12 in charisma. Okay. I think mine is 11 strength, 16 dex, 12 con, 10 int, 10 wisdom, and 19 charisma. Nice. Mm hmm? Oh, wait. Now I could probably put one point into strength, couldn't I? Take out a charisma. Because you don't get an extra point at 19, right? No, you don't. But at level 4, you get one point to put in any attribute you want. Oh, really? That's so if you have a 19, you can bump it up to 20. Mm, if you're going to be using a repeating crossbow, strength's probably not that going to be that useful to you. Hmm, yeah. That is a large bucket of popcorn, Michael. Your kids make that for you? Yeah, they did. Must be nice. That's a bucket itself. Yeah, we have a popcorn maker downstairs, so it's pretty nice. I wish my cat. Oh my gosh. Wow. It's bringing me dead mice. <laughs> you can eat them if you wanted to. Huh? No, I don't. <laughs> not if I don't want to, like, not get diseases and die. Aww. His yeah. kids bring him fully cooked corn kernels, okay? Well, get on that. Yeah, well, maybe I should have my cat learn how to cook rat, am I right? <laughs> mm -mm, tasty. <laughs> yum, 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 yum. Are ogres edible if they are Jewish? <laughs> you know, I don't know the exact rules for kosher, but they don't have cloven feet, so... Yes? Are humans kosher? <laughs> I'm gonna say yes to that. Yes. I'm gonna say no. Probably there's something in there that's like, also don't eat people. <laughs> Unless you're a Tengu. Because it's been confirmed in Arthur's game that Tengu's It's not been confirmed. It's just been Mason who... Well, he kills witches by stabbing them with nails, so... That's true. Don't move your head. No, don't move your head, Dave. You're literally taking up the chicken position. Damn it, you moved your head. <laughs> Sorry, I had to look. It looked like you were a rooster, because you had the rooster thing sprouting from your face. <laughs> it was good. It was so good. Uh, Alright. So I, need, I want to get that, that plus one mod for strength so I can carry things. Let's be honest, yeah? Oh wait, can can I eat along carry things? Yeah, yeah, right. Eat it on a backpack. Sweet. Yep. Quadruped. It could probably just use a saddle bag or some shit. Yeah, man. Fucking rip saddle. Yeah. 
The fuck is a rip saddle? Yeah. Or, as in like ripped, it's got like diamonds and shit on. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. did, did you put chrome spinners? <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, the evolution point, chrome spinners, you know? Um, so, all right. <laughs> so what is what is least likely to get used to enter wisdom? I'm probably going to drop wisdom, to be honest with you. Oh, no. Never drop wisdom. Yeah, why? Because drop wisdom every day. Never look back. I wisdom don't trust anything your... Dan says. So. <laughs> wisdom is attached to your will save, so that's going to be... Let's say someone gave you some tea and then whispered in your ear and told you to leave your party. Mm -hmm. That would be tied very directly to that role. But having said that, Inquisitor Mason had a plus three to his wisdom, so... Not very good. <laughs> <laughs> That's 16 a... points, bro. I get a plus six. Well. Yeah. And I had uh... And I dumped wisdom. <sighs> You dumped wisdom? I lowered wisdom. I didn't dump it into the ocean. I didn't no, dump I'm, it. I as in, like, I'm taking it to eight. You know, that's what I'm doing there. Make a negative one. Okay. Yeah, so his, his points are 10 strength, 16 dex, 12 con, 10 int, 8 wisdom, and 20 charisma. Or is it YOLO? Okay, I think that's it. Alright, yep. Um, now, what's the next thing I need to do for this guy? I need to make a Buckler character sheet. Buckley, sorry. Saddle with diamonds on it. Yeah, man. You went to Bejazzle, bejazzle for your butt bejazzle. seat out. <laughs> Bejazzled. Yeah. Oh, man. I can't believe this is a thing. What? Nothing. It's the weirdest <laughs> character creation session I've ever been a part of. And I've been a part of a lot of character creation sessions. And I've been a part of a lot. All right, listen, I'm going to start doing voiceovers of all the names that Graham came up with. <laughs> nice. My name's Gallagher Skaggs. I went out west to find gold. Instead, I opened up a whorehouse. Now I'm the richest man in town. Turns out all those fellas need some place to spend that gold. That's Gallagher Skaggs. I whore out my and daughters. I, and then I wound oh up God. on Pandora. <laughs> What? Who wound up on Pandora? Borderlands. Play it. Play it. Do it. You can want you make to. make a fantasy allegory of the team with that? Of course you can. You play an android. That's a race in Pathfinder. Really? They're robots that have souls. They live for a few hundred years, then the soul shuts down and a new one gets loaded. Mm -hmm. That seems. No one can explain it. Alright, um... I already did Ultra Ball Throckmort. Man, that's a good one. That's definitely a wizard. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Alright, so... Man, this is taking too long. I'm sorry, guys. Hmm. Summon's class skills are as follows. Why do they not put them in order? Fuck. Do I just put an X there? I want to talk about some things that I have picked up on the Steam store while I've got everyone's attention. Nice. While oh, we're waiting so for sad. these things to get done. I mean, you can continue the story with the other guys while we're building characters, and we can play them. Two, two characters. 
Yeah, like they sit there for a couple of hours and they're like, well, <laughs> <laughs> I guess now everyone's gone. That's what they do. They, they're like, well, I suppose if we wait at the tavern between three to five relatively similar leveled folks will show up and join us on our quest. Yeah, a guy riding, riding a fucking like star filled wind always blowing through his hair, his main griffin. And another fucking half elf, uh, sorry, halfling that's just like jogging to keep up. Yeah, that that fucking. You know she right. could ride the griffin. No, yeah. she's not gonna ride the griffin. That's my griffin. <laughs> mm. You could get pounce on the griffin and claw, so it would get three attacks, and it would jump in a melee range, wherein she could start attacking from melee. Ooh, Even better, if she got really good ride skill, she could fast dismount and then spend a uh, move action to slip around behind somebody and then start sneak attacking. Just saying, oh just offering options because I like making things really complicated and giving people a chance to murder themselves. Yes, that was an order of the stick reference. Thank you for noticing. <laughs> hmm. I picked up Ori in the Blind Forest. Obviously, I spent $1 at the Humble Bundle store for the E3 digital ticket, which all of you should do so you can play the fine game Mortal Warships. And then you can join my division and watch me fly into combat at high speeds, die almost instantly, and take out a bunch of other people while doing it. <laughs> Sounds fantastic. You get bonus points if you die by crashing your ship into an enemy after killing someone else in the process. Oh, you get free evolutions interesting is the avian avian like a bird is that like a, just a tengu style let's see here i will open up eidolon it's a form is like bird like in shape or is that an actual bird uh i don't even know what that's from man i don't avian, know what... it's the eidolon yeah, base the forms. source book is from c and c that's not Oh, okay. I, All right, I yeah, really I didn't that's see that. From. That's cool. Oh god. So I don't get any class skills as a as a Edelon, right? The, let's see here. I don't say skills. Yeah, no, Eidolon skills. The following skills are class skills. Bluff. Craft, knowledge planes, perception, sense mode. Hang on a second. Craft. I'm just going to send it to you in roll oh, 20. Please, yeah. In roll 20. Okay. Yeah, roll 20. Love, craft, int. Knowledge. Things. You know what? Now is another good time to announce that I will not be here. What? July 18th to the 25th. No, July 17th to the 19th. Is that going to be one of our weeks? The so third, 17th. Yeah, okay, so we won't be here in a month. I will be in Pennsylvania meeting up with my family members for our secret first annual uh, RPG retreat where all the members of my generation are going to show up and play RPGs with me. <laughs> That's cool. So I get, I get fly for free as a class skill, so I don't need to pick that as a class skill. I can pick other things. You mean yeah, okay. as a summoner you get fly? No, no, no. The Edelon gets four class skills that I can pick. And fly is a free one when you if gain If you have a fly. fly speed. Yeah. So, yeah, it's interesting. Um, oh, you God. You don't have a fly speed yet. I know, but I'll get it for free at a later level. Yes, yes indeed. What was that date you were out again? Uh, 17th through 19th. Okay. I'm pretty sure that's one of our weeks. That's one it of is. our Fridays. It is. Yeah, yeah. we're gonna we're not gonna be here for that week. I'll host Dave and Dave can do stuff. I can just host Dave that entire weekend. Mm -hmm. And that makes sense. 
Mm, and then, then two weeks after that, I won't be there either. You got that email, right? Wow, that's rough, man. That's a whole month of that is playing. Yeah. Going to Pennsylvania and play reenactment stuff. I, too, am going to Pennsylvania. Maybe you two are, like, secretly meeting up and you're not telling us. They're only yeah. two weeks apart, though. Yeah, two weeks apart. Secretly meeting up two weeks apart. All right. You're going to enjoy this. Are you going to Cooper's, too? So my guy picked up acrobatics. He picked up climb. He picked up diplomacy. He picked up knowledge and ability. Yeah. And he gets one more, I think. Is he actually going to be diplomatic? I would like this Eidolon to explain why. I'm a, I'm imagining he's like the the lion from the Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. Ah, so he's Aslan. Mm. I'm super wise and basically Jesus. Yeah, that's basically what I'm imagining here. So. so you're like, get money, what's up? And your summoning's like, I can't believe I travel with this. Yeah, it's, we're basically like a, a buddy cop drama. Oh. <laughs> um, what's a good nobilic? Probably another knowledge one, maybe. Geography? Yeah, fuck it. No history. We'll go history. Well, boom! All these are int skills, and I'm like, <laughs> he's got negative two int. <laughs> so, yeah, but at least you can roll it. Yeah. Wait, is linguistics like... Speaking languages. And he can't speak to other people, right? He can. He's capable of speech. He just has telepathy with you. All right, yeah, I'm taking linguistics then. Okay. All right, what's next? That's a good what one. What languages are you taking? Well, he's got negative two int, so probably... Every point of linguistics gives you one language. So you have common and... All right, I'm just going to work out how many points I get to put into things. Does it actually say? Well, well, yeah, yeah, it does say. I think it's going to be like eight. It's eight. Eight. I would suggest Elvin, so you can speak secretly with your... Yeah, telepathy is not enough. <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm going to take um, knowledge and ability. I'm going to put two ranks into that. L look at it from the other direction, right? If yeah. you hang out with elves all the time, wouldn't it be nice for your Eidolon to know what's ha what everybody's saying? Yeah, maybe. I'm not saying you hang out with elves all the time, but people normally hang out with people of the same race. Aren't, isn't half the party oh. elves already? Yes. All right, so I have uh, two points in linguistics, two points in perception, two points in acrobatics, and two points in nobility. So, Dan, half the party is in you and me, you mean? Yep. Yeah, half the party is elf, the other half is half elf. We both yeah, speak elven, though. So that means half and half is half and half and half? That's why I say we have, have you know, three half elves right now. Generic dual class we have half elven ranger. But we have a we have a full elf in there somewhere, with like oh. half an elf just hanging out. <laughs> My character is a half elf and a half elf. All right. So what else do I need to pick here? So, my Edelon has, I guess, saves. Dog is half orc. Other half also orc. Yep. So that works. my good saves is what? Fort save plus three. Ralph is not a traditional elven name, but I assume you already knew that. Traditional elven names are Caladril, Eladel, Landless. Is that really a man's name, Landless? <laughs> I'm just saying that sounds like Landfear from Wheel of Time. Reminds me of Landstill from Game of Thrones. So how do you, how do you how do you roll up um, Fortitude? Is it Strength? Uh, Constitution. Okay, so. Base save is one. Oh god, this is so stupid. Like, it doesn't, like, it just breaks. It just fucking, like, this whole thing fucking breaks when you don't have a class to put into it. So stupid. This is why I'm having so much problems. So my what base save that? is one. I'm using whatever the fuck this Pathfinder sheet is. And it doesn't have Eidolons in there, but it has Summoners, so it's like... Good one, Jack. Um... Base save is 
three. But ability modifier is three, and then base save is one, right? That's how it works. Sorry, what was the question? Um, base save is uh, one, and then ability modifier is three, right? Uh, if you have a three, then yes. Okay, so yeah, all right. You have and a plus reflex three is constitution. Reflex is dex. No, I have uh, in fort saves. I have a plus three. Really? Yeah, yes. that would be constitution to get a plus three in that. Well, no, the base save is the Ow. con, and the ability modifier is plus three, right? Your ability modifier is going to be your con. Modifier. All right, so fine. And then, what's the base save then? Or I mean, is it for summoner or for Eidolon? It's for Eidolon. Basically, I'm trying to fill out this form that yeah. nor normally automatically fills out, and it's fucking annoying. So. Okay, Eidolon, you're. No, I have all the stats here. I'm just trying to work out which one goes where, so I don't get Quadruped. confused. Fort is your good. Yes, your fort is a plus three. And your uh, constitution Reef is a plus one, so you should have a plus four. Yeah, I have a four in con, a reflex, reflex is five because of the ability modifier two and the base save of three. Yep, that sounds right. All right. Uh, now, what is my attack? My base attack bonus is uh, two. For two. The line. And then, so four? Uh, that would be your attack, yes. Your bab is two, your attack would be four. What did you put your idol on points into, if I could ask? Um, I haven't gone that far yet, I'm sorry. Okay. Still trying to build the sheet. So base oh, attack fine. bonus is two, then? Yes. And what is my bab two? Bab three, bab four, what the fuck is that? I don't know what that is. Alright, so I think uh, everything is working now, then. Okay. Um, so my bite, my attack bite is a one d six. I think we're coming up on a break here. If we wanna. Yeah, you guys can take a break. Keep working break. on that. All right, guys. I know we've got some riveting stuff here for these first time viewers. <laughs> so follow, like, and subscribe. We'll be back in a little under ten minutes here. If you're a new viewer, you missed out on Mason. Yeah, you did miss it on mm -hmm. Mason. You should go back and watch mm -hmm. all the old Mason videos to know what you missed. I'm so annoyed that my party's like, eh, I don't want to do anything <laughs> to bring in Mason again. Oh, so frustrating. Press to pay respects. That's all I gotta say. Yeah. A lot of people press to have.